Hi friends, thank you so much for tuning in to another video. If you hear any noise in the background, I do have fans going because it's currently 106 degrees and even the air conditioner is not helping with that heat. So I do apologize for that in advance. But today I have for you something super exciting. It is a Calico Critters blind bag unboxing. So if you want to see these open, let's go ahead and get started. So what I have is three different Calico Critters blind bag series and one of the Honeybee Acres baby box with accessories. The Honeybee Acres is like Calico Critters, but it's just Walmart's version. It's a lot more affordable. So in this video, I also kind of want to compare the two together to see if the quality is the same, but we are going to go ahead and start with the blind bags first. I have the costume series, the outdoor series, and the music series. So we're just going to go ahead and jump right in. All right, so it looks like, oh my God. Oh no, I thought we had the mystery one right here, but it's this little one right here, number seven. It does not have a name, but it looks like a ghost cat. So these do come in blind bags, but once you open them, they just come in this clear plastic. These definitely look a lot smaller than the actual Calico Critter babies. I don't have one on hand, but I would say these are definitely smaller. So this little guy is so very cute. He definitely, I think, is one of the Persian cats. I have a Persian cat, Calico Critter, and that's what it felt like as well. And then you kind of just snap him in here. I love this idea of these costume ones because I love Halloween. So this will definitely go out during Halloween as a decoration piece. There is a Halloween set that I really wanted to get, but it sold out before I could get my hands on it. It has like a Frankenstein dog. I really want it. But here it is all dressed up. This this is actually a lot cuter than I thought it was going to be. Like I'm actually obsessed with this little guy. He's so cute. All right, so here we have one of the tuxedo cats. I also have one of these play sets, so I know that that's what it is. This one's so very cute. I'm not sure what accessory it has, but we'll see. And it looks like this one didn't come in a blind bag, which I like. The other one, that was impossible to get out. But this is cute. This is the size of the baby. So the other one is definitely like half the size. I thought for some reason this one seemed really small. I'm not sure why it's that small, but it is. Maybe it's because with the ghost costume. No, even with the ghost costume on, it's still really small. All right, and it looks like our friend has just a little cat-shaped basket or bucket. Not sure how this is musical, but that's really, really cute. Maybe this is not a musical series. Maybe this is a camping series because I see one of them has a frying pan. Okay, so this is baby camping series, not music. I saw one of them with a guitar and I assumed it was a music series, but this is the camping one. So there she is going to catch the little fish or whatever. This one's really cute. <laughs> this one's okay this is not one that i wanted but we'll go ahead and get it out i think it's a chipmunk and i'm not sure what accessory it has this one was also not in a blind bag so this is really cute i just don't understand why they don't have tails even though they're babies but that's cute So this one came with quite a few accessories. He's got a little hat. It doesn't actually go on his ears. There's like indents for his ears, but it doesn't fit that well. And then it looks like maybe a little map of some sort. That's a huge old map. Oh, there you go. 
That's adorable. And I guess this is the sticker for the map and I'll put that on later, but that one's actually kind of cute. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and open our Honeybee Acres and this one is Baby Ollie. This box is so incredibly cute. I actually wanted to get all of them, but I wound up only picking three. You'll see two more of them in later videos, but these are absolutely adorable. After I bought the original three, I went back to get more and I couldn't find them anywhere. So I don't know if they're super popular or Walmart just found out this line didn't sell. I'm hoping that it's that they were really popular because I think these are so cute and they actually have some really nice play sets that I want to get but we'll go ahead and open him up All right, so there it is, and it looks like it came with a little, I don't know, what is this, cradle? I wish it came with, like, stuff for the inside, but I realized that this playset was more on the affordable side. I do have some bedding from other baby calico critter sets, so that's definitely not a problem. It rocks really, really nicely, so that's cute, and I love the little bee because it's honeybee acres. And here is our little mouse. I, at least I think it's a mouse. Well, his little tail says it's a mouse, so that's cute. I think he's permanently see. No, his, okay, awesome his legs move. So with a lot of the calico critters, when they're in the seated position, they're permanently like that. So his little legs moved. I don't know if his arms do, but regardless, he's really cute. So he could either be sitting up in this or laying down and he actually fits quite perfectly. I will say that it has the same like flocking on it. This definitely feels a little bit better quality than this, but this is not bad. They weigh about the same. And as you can see, these ones are just a bit taller but the calico critters are definitely chunkier but overall i would say they're about the same so far so good so i don't really see a problem with this one at all all right friends so that's absolutely everyone we're opening for this video i actually had a really good time opening these i've had them actually forever probably two years at this point so i'm really sad that i didn't open them sooner but i'm really happy to have them in my collection like i said if you have the chance to buy the honeybee acres one because you can't afford the calico critters ones i will say that the honeybee acres ones were probably almost three dollars cheaper so it is definitely more affordable but i would definitely say go ahead and buy them they're definitely comparable so that's absolutely awesome another thing is right as i was recycling the packaging i did realize that they have names on them and i was like oh sad they don't have names but we'll go ahead and read it out so this one is a chipmunk and his name is jordan hazelnut chipmunk i love when names are like that creative and then our little camping one is peppermint to tuxedo cat. Wow, I'm really good at figuring out what kind of animals these are. And then our little ghost baby is Blair Persian cat. Wow, I was three for three. I got each one of those right. But either way, this video was super exciting. I think my favorite for the video, even though he's just a tiny little baby, is the Persian cat back there. In the comments below, definitely let me know which one was your favorite and why. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up because it really does help out the channel. Don't forget to subscribe as well as turn on that notification bell. That way, when the next Calico Critters unboxing goes up on the channel, you'll be notified. But other than that, I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I will definitely see you in the next one. Bye, friends!